Hello there, lads, lasses, and all of my other pals. Did I jump scare you? Yeah, I bet I did. You coward. Well, it's August 8th, 2024. You know what that means. Fish, I mean, Five Nights at Freddy's 1 has reached its 10 year anniversary. So I decided to make a cool little video on it. Here we go. <laughs> Five Nights at Freddy's is a franchise that I love. I love the games, I okay with the books, I love the movie, and the fan base is tolerable, except when it's not. And that's great, it's incredible really. This game series began as of releasing this video 10 years ago, and it's such a weird thing to think about. Because for a lot of us, we grew up or were even raised along with this game series. I was 4 when this first game came out, and I'm turning 15 years here. How crazy is that? This franchise really means a lot to me. I know almost, almost everything that there is to know about this game. And it stays alive because of the fan content that there is. Fan games, fan art, fan music, fan My dudes were leaked on Twitter.com! Fan mods, fan films, and so much more. And every day something like that is created, especially today since it's, you know, the 10 year anniversary of the game series. Did you not read the title? Do I have to spell it out for you? Dumbass. Asking what's the future of FNAF is like asking Smash Mouth what they think of years. They start coming and they don't stop coming. That's through the rules that hit the ground running. Please stand by! What I'm trying to say is that I'm not sure if FNAF is ever gonna stop. As Theo Wolf says, FNAF will only end when Star Wars ends. And we all know that's never gonna happen. So, there will be more games, more books, movies, all that stuff. And there may be some misses, but there will definitely be a lot of hits. Because this franchise is truly great. And I love it so much. I grew up with Five Nights at Freddy's. I grew up being too scared to play the games, but also loving watching other people who are too scared to play the games. I grew up watching this franchise grow up, and there's really no other franchise like that for me. It's why I am the person I am today. FNAF made me want to play pretend as the animatronics with my friends, which let me want to act. And the characters made me want to make my own, leading me to make OCs and draw more. And the game itself inspired me to want to make my own games. So thank you, FNAF, and thank you, Scott Cawthon. So yeah, that's it. See you guys next time. Bye bye.